Hi everyone, welcome back or welcome to my channel. Today I wanted to film something a little bit different and it's gonna be a makeup decluttering video. So I wanted to film an intro because for some people you're gonna be like, why on earth does she have this much makeup? So to give you a little bit of backstory, I'm a licensed cosmetologist. I've been a makeup artist. Well, I was a makeup artist for several years. So I accumulated a lot of stuff obviously for that job and then I also just love makeup and I've been a makeup enthusiast since you know I was a preteen so this collection has been over several years I already know that there is going to be a majority of makeup that is expired and I just need to throw away which makes me sad because I'm definitely a makeup collector too you know I keep makeup if I love the packaging or if it holds some type of sentimental value to me uh, so I know I'm gonna have to <laughs> let some go, but I need to, you know, now that I'm a mom and, you know, obviously I work full time and I don't do makeup professionally anymore, there's just no need for me to have this much makeup. The makeup that you see me wearing is pretty much what I wear all day, every day. I don't really do anything crazy. I know I want to keep enough makeup, you know, when I go on date night or when I go out with my friends and I want to get all dolled up. I obviously want to have the makeup to do so but I just know what I own at this point is really excessive and I can let things go give some things to friends throw some away uh, so I really wanted to go through it the vanity in and of itself and I'll insert clips either before this or, or while I'm talking so my vanity mirror my husband actually made for me back when we were dating so I don't think I could ever let that go <laughs> but I'm obsessed with it and then the actual vanity the all the pieces are from ikea the tabletop as you'll see is damaged so i either need to replace one or replace it or get contact paper for it and then the actual drawers like the classic ikea alex 5 drawers i think anybody who knows or watches makeup or beauty youtube everybody knows what these are so mine are disgusting and dirty and dingy i've had them for 10 years now uh, so i think we're gonna go through kind of drawer by drawer category by category and just weed them out and just kind of go through and see what i can let go and see what i think is worth keeping enough of me talking let's go ahead and just get right into the video start with my powders I will probably time lapse through this because I don't know how long it's gonna take me and if I talk it'll take me 20 times longer so we'll just speed through and I'll check in when I'm done okay so to talk about it quickly this is what I'm keeping these I'm not sure of. I think I'm going to combine um, these palettes. This one obviously is broken and cracked um, and there's not, there are a few blushes in here that I want to keep and some I'm going to get rid of. So I'll just swap them around and get rid of one of the palettes. 
And then these are all going to be either donate or trash. I know my best friend needs blushes, so there are a few in here that I'll give to her. And then I know my baby cousins want some makeup too, so this will go to them. dive into honestly the most dreaded part which is all of my lipsticks lip glosses lip liners um there are a bunch of these that i got um i remember was it nordstrom rack maybe and they're honestly just pieces of shit so i'll probably get rid of most of these it's gonna look like a lot but they were super cheap so it's not like i spent a ton of money on them and then yeah we're gonna go through this chaos Okay, I feel really good about this and this took me forever. Um, so these are all trash because either I've used them or they're expired and just disgusting. Uh, these ones are donate or give to like my friends. Uh, they are either completely unopened or I just like swatch them. Uh, so these will go into that pink bin and then these are all keeps. So I went through, like, it looks like, I don't know how it's coming off on camera but it looks like I have a lot of the same color, but they're either different formulas, different finishes, some are plumping glosses, some are regular. So there is a wide variety. And as you saw, I went through um, each and every one I kept getting rid of even more. Uh, so I'm really happy with this. I'm gonna put them all back, like organize as best as I can, and then we'll go through the lip liners. So these are the lip liners I'll be throwing away. Once again, expired or used or gross. These ones are all untouched. So these I will be putting in my giveaway bin. And then these are the ones I'm keeping. Uh, once again, super stoked about that. This, as you saw, was like over full and now it's not even halfway full. Uh, so I know that these will actually get use and get love. All right, so this next drawer, I don't think we'll be getting rid of too much besides like eyelashes. Uh, this is kind of my everyday drawer. So like these are, you know, my tweezers, my mascara. So I know there's nothing out of this bin I'll get rid of. However, I do know I definitely have some foundations that are expired and I know I don't need all these lashes. So this will be pretty quick. So just I thought really quick just getting rid of three foundations that are just obviously as you can see super separated and old I mean those are probably at least well over a year old and then just a couple lashes I think I, I must have gone through this recently because I thought there were more but yeah I'm just gonna get rid of these lashes give them away they're obviously unused besides this pair um, which there's still one good pair in there of the magnetic lashes Now we're getting into some of the fun stuff. Oh, these aren't supposed to be in there. These are loose pigments, single shadows, and then some eyeliners, liquid shadows, liners, that type of thing. And obviously I'm gonna have to clean that out. I know exactly which one that is from. But yeah, let's go ahead and zoom through and declutter. harder for me than I thought it would be because these are just so pretty but I am going to get rid of all of these and keep these 
once again, really stoked with how much I'm able to let go of. Um, yeah, so let me put these away. And next is eyeshadow palette. Yes, I do know this is a ridiculous amount of eyeshadow palettes. Clearly, that is my favorite thing to buy, but holy shit, I do not need all of these, nor do I use all of these. Um, some of these are untouched because they came in boxy charms. So, I'm gonna try to be as harsh as I can, because I know my first instinct is I wanna keep all of these for different reasons, but, I know I can get rid of some. So let me buckle down and see what I can get rid of. I'm letting go of it's just like a makeup forever magnetic thing but like I, I don't need it I don't ever I've never had a situation where I need it so this pile are all the ones I am letting go <laughs> and that's really hard for me and this is really really this is a lot so there's just like as much as I love this palette and it is beautiful and it is a literal masterpiece I just don't use it I have these colors over here and that's just the case for a lot of these, you know, while they're beautiful and I love them and they've served me well, I just don't need to keep all of them. So yeah, so these ones I'll go through. Some of these unfortunately are untouched. Like this one from Alamar Cosmetics is untouched, but I either have the colors elsewhere or this color story in particularly, like I wouldn't travel with this one. It really... I just, I don't need it. I don't need it. Uh, same with like this little Illuminati one, this pure one. There are so many in here that are unfortunately untouched, but they will go to a different home and be left somewhere else. And then as far as these, I know it looks like a lot and it is a lot. However, they're either ones that I specifically love traveling with, like this one from Dose of Colors is perfect when I want to do like a romantic smoky eye, like a mauve one. And then my Too Faced and my Urban Decays, like these just, I'm keeping them, okay? And I'm getting rid of a lot, so don't judge me. <laughs> okay, so this is everything I'm letting go of, and I really could not be more happy. I'm proud of myself, because as a makeup collector and a makeup lover, this is a lot of makeup to give away. But I know it's going to go to homes that they'll be appreciated and actually used and not just sitting in a drawer, so that makes me happy. And let's roll into the pleasing footage of everything put away nice and neatly. That is it for this decluttering video. I hope you found it satisfying or interesting, anything. <laughs> if you have any videos that you'd like me to make, whether they're makeup related, cleaning related, lifestyle, honestly, whatever suggestions you have, please leave them down below and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.